Oh, I'm thinking uh, they're starting a brand new class for the Chromebooks to like do repairs and like help students out. Yeah, so I'm thinking of doing that. I'm like signing up for that. And what is that called? Uh, CSS. Yeah. Or C C yeah, something C. Yeah, yes. Okay. I'll probably have to ask the mm -hmm. from that. Um, and so, what will you be doing in the process? Oh, for the like in the class, so there's gonna be. Uh, there's, they're going to cover all the like logistics and stuff like that to like organize all the students because they're going to be like over 2,000 Chromebooks, so that's going to be really interesting. And they're going to have to. They're starting it over the summer, so they're going to have two interns to do help with that. So. Okay, and you're interested in being interested. Yeah. Okay, and so will you be fixing any? Issues that might come up with Chromebooks. Oh uh, yeah, if like some kid that like, comes uh, to like the classroom and says like, "Oh, I broke the screen or like the keyboard," like we have to fix that. Okay. And what got you interested in possibly being an intern? Oh, uh, I just like I like I wanted to, uh, some job over the summer, and I really like computers. Like. Over the years uh, in the high school, I used to like help uh, my friends like fix laptops and other stuff. So I, I think I would be like perfect for that. Yeah. And why do you like computers so much? I, I guess it was like I don't know. I always like as a kid, I used to like take apart toys and like fix stuff or like try to figure out how it works. So that's probably why. And how excited are you to be able to practically use your talents here? Um, it would be like amazing for me. Yeah. Um, so, how do you think this will help the students? Uh, well, like better technology, improving everything, and you won't have to carry like heavy books and stuff like that. And it will actually be, for the long run, it will be cheaper for the school, like in place of books and everything. And a part of it is that all of the work they do goes to the cloud, right? Yeah. So how helpful do you think it is for students to be able to access stuff to the cloud? Oh, it's really easy. You can access it on your phone or anything like that. And you could like you can't have like the, the excuse that you like forgot papers or something at home, like your books. So yeah. Yeah, I've actually forgotten a, a notebook in this chemistry class in high school. <laughs> <laughs> to track down the, the teacher, so that's great. Um, how important do you feel technology is in education today? Oh, very. <laughs> like yeah. everything's moving so fast. So they like they look, some of the computers here like are a little bit outdated. So like it would be really nice to have like brand new Chromebooks and stuff like that. So how do you think the students being able to use Chromebooks will help prepare them for that changing landscape? Well, Chromebooks are like. Basically, like the simplest like way of like doing anything, like most offices and stuff like that, will make you do like uh, Excel stuff like that, and the Chromebooks prepare you for that, like writing papers online, emails, anything like that. Okay, and do you know anything about? I know you know the technical side. Mm -hmm. I'm just wondering, do you know anything about how it will be used? Uh, how? Like in the classroom. Well, in the classrooms, uh, there's already classes. Like, we have in-class Chromebooks, so we use them for, like, assignments, like, reading on them, making, like, yeah. And what do you think the advantages might be to use it in a classroom setting versus uh, just someone's personal laptop? Well, it, it's easier for, like, testing and stuff. So, like, you take a test in class, and you don't have to wait for the teacher to grade it. It's automatically, like, graded. Like, uh, that's, uh, Google Classroom does that with, uh, what's that one? I forgot what the program is. Uh, well, yeah, there's like an option in the thing, so like it lets you, the teacher, it lets the teacher automatically grade it and submits the grades into it. Okay, so how, how does that work again? Do they have like a key that the computer uses? Or? Yeah, yeah, when the teacher writes the test for like the students, it, they already select all the answers. So when you press submit, it shows you like all the stuff you got wrong or yeah, your score. So that really eases yeah. the burden on teachers. It's great. I, I didn't know that. <laughs> Thanks. Um, and is there any, well, I guess also just going off that, what was your, you kind of mentioned this, but what was your initial reaction? And do you have feelings? I know you mentioned you're excited. Are you also nervous, maybe? Or? Kind of. Like, there's going to be, 
I'm, like, there's definitely gonna be a lot of broken Chromebooks like in the first probably couple months because kids won't like, handle them right. But yeah, like people people get used to it. Yeah, and you're getting ready for that. Yeah.